Welcome Who's to Hollywood. Hollywood. You here before? And if I hadn't seen you, neither was Isaac. So that's a big step. What? Isaac's in the jewelry store at the end of the street. Consider yourself invited. One. Ah, Hollywood. Dead ass. I'm trying to grab him and see if I can snap his neck. Probably you can talk to him. Yes, he was the guy who just told us to go see Isaac. Oh. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You forget <laughs> boobs. <laughs> My brain does no longer function. Oh god, we're gonna have to go fight that bloody gargoyle, aren't we? We're gonna piss the fucking thing off. I'm more interested in Vivi. Vivi won't talk to us because we're gonna call her a whore. <laughs> we'll beat her with her own leg. You can still look at her. Good evening, Neonate. Evening. 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 Sorry, you haven't got the boobs. You haven't got the boobs when you want to. Yes, he wants to say two. So you've come to barter information with the sewer rats. The crime must really be desperate and stupid in sorting with their kind. And asking for the help of all peoples. Two. Not so fast. Before you go, there is the matter of tribute. Well, there is no option. Go me old fashioned. But this is my barony, and as is tradition, a token of respect must be. Two. Ah, so perfect class. Glad to see the rebelliousness of youth lives on. I put it away in this office. Bring me out. You might enjoy this. Two. If you're the best thing the prince has got to send my way, his run will be a short one. I've been running this town since before your grandparents learned how not to crap themselves. Do you really believe you get back to your prince in one piece? But it doesn't have to come to that. All that I ask is that you pay your proper tribute, just like every other kindred that comes through Hollywood. No more, no less. What? What I want is a simple exchange. Last week I paid for a certain item. Oh, God. Only. And this evening I got an email saying that the seller is ready to deliver it. Unfortunately, he's become a bit paranoid on the sudden. Both my favorite and most hated part of the game. Yep. Yep. That guy is sleazy. <sighs> that film. That film, that film, that film. Oh, the terrible and wonderful adventure I had with that film number two. Absolutely not. You pull that cowboy routine anywhere in my city, and I'll personally take an interest in seeing you suffer. I had in mind something a bit more subtle. Now pay attention. Here's what I want you to do. Go to the Ground Zero Internet Cafe. Look for a directory named Joseph K. and use the password Kafka. There'll be an email in there that will specify a nearby location. Meet the contact, pick up the item, come back. Not too painful, right? What? What? Excellent. In the meantime, consider yourself a welcome guest in my barony. Welcome to Hollywood. What? No problem. Okay, let's... Well, at least he doesn't hate us yet. He, he's definitely the most reasonable of all the characters. Well, they're all reasonable until we start rolling the dice. Hey, we said some pretty nasty things to him. He was still like, it's okay, you're young. Just do the thing and I'm fine with you. Uh, oh my gosh, is that you? A fucking woman! I forgot about her. Stupid bitch. What? Is it drugs? Something like that? Look, let me make a call and we'll get you some help. Nobody's judging you. I'll be happy when you're in place. Two. Uh, there's no two. Let me make a call and we'll get everybody together. This was the first masquerade violation I ever got. The important thing is you can know that you're alive. Fuck you, fuck you too. I don't think you know what you're saying. We're gonna help you. You'll see, everybody just wants to see you safe and back to yourself. We had some hot friends before we died. She's pixelated. 
But she's hot. Trance her. Why? So she doesn't. Isn't she gonna phone now? There we go, we got our masquerade redemption. Go Wookie! Uns, 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 uns. Did we really need that mouse? Yes. I mm. love the sprinters. <laughs> <laughs> Fast moving little bastards. Yeah, because if you don't transfer, she finds your family and says, Hey, dude's here. Somehow that's a violation. Get your tits out of my way. Or don't. The Deb of Night. There is actually a band called a Boulder Serial. Looks like nice. Very cool. Um, generic metal band, but very, very fun. Three. No, it's shopping. Okay, yeah, shopping is exactly. Yes. Have you ever heard, noticed that there is a certain someone we are familiar with who calls into the Deb show? There's quite a few people. The, the yacht guy. Uh huh. Like, I have a yacht. Oh, do you say, tell me? No, you wouldn't know the brand. It's Italian. Yes. <laughs> now that now I have to go there. One. Uh, hey, you know you should really ask me about the special, you know. I'm glad you asked that, bro. You know, they voluntarily eat the rest of their something. I got the special. Well, those guys really need Jesus. Burrito, so you never sleep at night. I assume you do sleep, right? Yeah. Yeah. Sleep at work. And what exactly do you do? I'm a middle school teacher. That would explain why my nephew invested that twenty I sent him for his birthday on magic beans. It's always good to know that the future of our country is in good hands, isn't it? Oh boy. Let's see who else we got. Caller. Buy a fucking gun, Roger. Okay, and what do you do, Roger? Um, I'm a. I'm a. <laughs> Writer, Dan. So have you. This is why we're struggling. We're not struggling. We're kicking all sorts of. We're doing no damage when we hit people with the floppy arm. Madam, how dare you insult my floppy arm? I'm right here and insult my floppy arm. My floppy arm is a very hard floppy arm. It pounds well, damn it. Not to the security guards in the museum. They had it coming. Ash Rivers, nice. Tang Swan, hey Ginger Swan. <laughs> Been dead a long time. Bloody chair attacked me. Did you see that chair attack me? Onward. And upward and inward. Hi ho, silver spoon. Collide. Nice bands. Good posters. Whoop, whoop, cheeky, cheeky, whoop. Chiggy, chiggy. Huge <laughs> floppy breasts. Oh god, yes. Where is he? Behind something. Oh, behind the coffee shop, isn't it? You can read the email. Uh. I didn't read it, I just looked at it and then moved on with my life. Hey, I wonder if now that we've got the patched up version, Vivi won't randomly lose texture now. <laughs> Ser <laughs> Seriously, you actually noticed? That there was texture loss? Yeah. Wow, I didn't notice that sort of thing at all, ever, never. When the boobs are nothing but red and white checkered squares. I never had such an issue. That's because you masturbate too much. That is not 
Yes, but <laughs> what's the <laughs> point? Yes. What's the option, damn it? Three. All right. Sorry. It's just that... I mean, something is... I just want out of this whole thing. I don't want anything to do with that damn tape. Well, tough to tea. I don't know. I mean, when it comes to video, I've seen everything. And I do mean everything. But this thing... It's sick. It can't be real, but... I got it morphine is. for it. I know it. It's real, and it scares the hell out of me. Ooh. Two. You have no idea. It's disgusting. That girl. The things that are happening to her. It just ain't right, man. It just ain't right. No. So Mandarin. Is that that's like the Japanese, that's the uh, Asian fellow. Okay. He works for, Three. for uh, Ming Zhao. Well, number two for you. I have it. I stashed it someplace. Look, you need to find Ginger Swans. Huh? What the hell was that? Shit. Did you see that? He's got a really Fuck big right hand. And splat. Like, share, and subscribe. See you in the next